I had a text today from the Irish Times, no less. And I will read it to you now because it is highly uh, insulting. And, uh, you know, first of all, well, it says the Irish Times, it's from a journalist, Peter, Peter Murta, who have had dealings with in the past and they have been deeply unpleasant. But Peter Murta anyway wrote today in a text, I'm not sure how he got my mobile number, but anyway, the Irish Times is proposing to publish a news feature on various matters related to individuals and purported organizations associated with anti-European activism. It's so scary, isn't it? This anti-European union, sorry, European union activism. In the course of research into this, we have become aware of a Rowan Croft, a so-called citizen journalist with far right and anti-migration Islamophobic views, who has filmed both IREXIT Freedom Party meetings and some of your own activities and on material that has been both broadcast both on his video channel and on the IREXIT and Munter Neheran websites. This stage I'm quaking, shaking in my boots. Do you, okay, no wait, can you tell me anything of your association with Croft or do you wish to comment on him in any way? Do you have any comment to make about Croft promoting your views on various matters by virtue of rebroadcasting some of your video interviews? What is your relationship with Croft? If Gran Torino is watching, he will be ringing his solicitor, I imagine, as we speak. I'm going to deal with this bit first, right? And then we'll move on to the rest of the nonsense from Peter Murta. I'll just say, if you're still buying the, read, the our, our reading, the Irish Times, if you're still buying it, you're brainwashed. <laughs> 